Yo, yo, peeps, how's it going? And welcome back to, uh, Aperture Tag, okay? What may actually be the last episode and the last episode of the last Let's Play on this channel. But yeah. Uh, so, I'm actually playing, like, right after the last episode ended, so, yeah, hopefully there won't be any interruptions or anything. So, yeah. So, yeah, let's see, uh... Let's see what, uh, you know, that, um, uh, that Nigel guy, he has a lot of explaining to do. I'm mean, like, like, I mean, I just destroyed a re reactor core, I don't know what it's doing, it's not, yeah. Terrific navigational skills there. This has been a very successful experiment, so far. Mm-hmm. I'm not sure I want to go that way. If I'm supposed to go that way, then I kind of want to go the other way, just to see what's up there. Oh wait, I can go both ways? Uh, okay, I'm gonna real quickly save. And like, if one of them turn out to be like, um... If one of them turn out to be, like, some sort of, like, secret ending or something, then I'll come back to this oh, part. I should mention, you were never authorized personnel. Me saying that was part of testing protocol. You were just an average, unimportant test subject. Okay. Well, that's mean. Okay, well, I guess it wasn't an alternate ending. Okay. Okay, now, let's see. Okay. Right here. But you are most definitely above average. Oh, sweet. Hey, Nigel, I can finally see you! Oh, I can't splash one. I can finally see you! It's, it's so nice. Okay. Anyways, um. Oh, oh, he's on a rail. Okay. Yeah, there we go. There he is. I should wait. Can't I just... Yeah, I can just go on here. Here. Be what I need to do. Here. Oh. Oh, okay, well, I still got it up there, so that's nice. Here. And then. Does that turn it off? No, it doesn't turn. Okay. Oh, but it does open the door. Okay, so that's good. And now. Did it. Oh wait. 
like I said, it's supposed to put detail here. Oh well. Here and then done. Good work. You should have noticed that the flow direction on the green fizzlers matter. If you did not notice that, please fill out the appropriate submission forms at the end of the test. Okay. I know what you must be wondering. What are we testing for? How is this going to end? Where else has Nigel lied to me? When did I learn his name was Nigel? <laughs> Why does it look like I'm outside? Where is he getting with all these questions? Uh, this is the part where you answer all the questions, Nigel. To level letter or has taught me anything, it's that these are called edgeless safety cubes. I guess he's gonna give me the answer, and the answer is gonna be let me a answer that question with the question. Who here wants to make sixty dollars cash? And woo! I am pretty sure I mentioned my name somewhere before. Don't worry though; those other answers will all be answered later on. It's not like we will end the test abruptly. We have more than enough funding. Thanks, Atranium. Okay. Okay, so we need some questions to push our testing forward. Give you a reason to keep you engaged with the test. How do we know you are not going to idle for an hour before you solve this test chamber? See, even I have questions that need some answering. Good point. Maybe if I wasn't a silent protagonist, I could answer that. I think it's green gives you the... No. Oh wait, yeah, it was green. Okay. I was just using the wrong gel. This green gives it and purple takes it away. Oh, that just drops them. Fancy.
I do, I do like the little detail of, like, all the floating platforms have, like, wires and cables suspending them. That's essentially the detail. It's nice that this isn't just, like, some sort of, like... Oh, wait. I just realized I probably did this wrong. Anyways, it's, uh, it's nice attention to detail that, um... Is that the exit? Okay. Anyways, it's nice attention to detail that they uh, have that and, like, nothing is just, like, suspending on thin air. Okay, how do I get past this? Hey, I can just... I think, I think what I need to do is I need the cube back if I... Oh wait, but if I get the cube back, then how am I gonna... Yeah, how am I gonna go up there if I don't have this cube? Puzzling question. Very puzzling question. Oh okay, now I need to get the dot. And I also need to get the cube back for the... Great, now I'm just starting on phase in square one again. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, just want to check. Okay, then we do this. Okay. Back, like this. Juice on the bridge. Oh, wait a minute! I know what I'm supposed to do here. Post to do a little something like this. Wait, do I have a gel in it? I have like unlimited amounts of gel. I guess that makes sense. I guess we wouldn't really want to uh, make the game like too much. Is there? Is there I think that's probably enough. Ah, dang it! Ow! I just realized what I was supposed to do, and now I can't do it. Really? Okay, well, it saved me at this spot, so that's good. for quite a while, what? just doing nothing, supposedly thinking how to solve the test. Oh yeah, you did a terrific job. Keep it up. Ah, oh, fireworks is so nice. Thank you. Okay. Starting to think that Nigel doesn't like me very much. This test chamber is divided in two parts. One where you get the three cubes, and another when you get to the exit. Good luck. Okay. Wow, oh, can use blue gel.
Anytime. Try that again, but uh, this time I got a better idea. I'm gonna make this work. like down under on the floor like are they spraying neurotoxin down there or this is just foggy this is like made of fun okay and come on come on come on now Try that strategy one more time before assuming that that's not what I'm supposed to do, and that okay, that time didn't count. Okay, and <gasps> yes, I don't think this is how I was supposed to get over here, but you know what? I don't really care. Matters is that I got here in the end, so that's nice. Okay. Oh, ooh. Very nice.
really don't want to make these things bouncy because then I might accidentally end up messing everything up. Alright, I guess I don't really have much of a choice. Okay. Oh, I probably should have done. Ah! Dang it! And now it's gonna fall off. Am I gonna get a replacement or no? Oh, thank goodness I got a replacement. Okay, good. That would have been super unfair if they didn't do that. It's unfair, not fun fair. Man, t these tests, man, they, they really get your brain thinking. They really get your noggin to start working overtime. Nope, that didn't work. Okay. I think I was supposed to use uh, blue bear, blue raspberry on that part. Okay, and then we go through the portal. Oh wait, orange juice. I want the blue raspberry. the edge already. Thank you. I do it. Okay, good. Wait, what? No. There we go. There we go. Now, there we go. Okay. Blue gel here. And then. Good job, there. young lad. Your papa and mama should be proud. Who designed this testing protocol? Sometimes I feel like they just make this stuff up as they go along. This... Yeah, that was funny. Okay. Let's move along to the next test. Let's see what we got next for us. Now, this test chamber is located in a real desert. Don't worry. You'll obtain a complimentary citranium can at the end of the test. I know I will. Citranium. It's science in a can. <laughs> yeah, I don't think this is a real desert. Where is this lead? Oh, it just launches me upward. Tranium logo. You can tell us how they got most of their funding. This one test. I got hundred they probably got millions of dollars from this one test they made. Oh, I'm supposed to have a cube probably. Why am I gonna find a cube? So, okay, I can land. Oh, 
wait, what do I want to put over there? I don't think I would want to put on... Um, maybe I want to... Hmm. I don't know why I'd want to put there. Let me go over there real quick and check it out. other cubes around here. I should probably look to see if there are any pipes or anything. Yeah, I think I got an idea of what I'm supposed to do now. Supposed to get it in there through here. Then there we go. Okay. I go over there, draw the cube, and then we do some cubey things. What? What did that button do? I, oh, it turned this off. Okay. I guess that would help. I guess that would probably help out. A bit. vending machine and well it seems that we've run out of citranium cans at the moment 
Don't panic though, I will personally see that you get your citranium can at the end of the test. Okay. Do you feel angry at the end of a test chamber, or alone, or depressed? The new Aperture Science Exotic Location staging will eliminate all of those feelings by simulating the authentic outsides that the humans were born to roam. Eh. Okay. Okay, again, both types. Round the back. Oh, that just makes another drop on the ceiling. Okay. Leave this cube here, maybe it'll become important later on. Yeah. Here, I do that. Here. Okay, then I do this. And then I guess I just do the usual stuff like this. Okay. what we're doing here. Bouncy Bomble. The power of the Bouncy Bomble, we shall become immortal. Okay, so. How do I get rid of that, though? So I, I can't. I probably can't. So I try. I don't think I can. Yeah, I can't reach it with just this. Heal something extra. Oh wait! I know how. Oh wait, that didn't help, that just made things worse.
Stumper, this is a real this is a real tough one to figure out. Still experienced a negative emotion while testing? Fill out the appropriate submission form at the end of the test. <laughs> okay. A not so fun fact the water in this test is recycled from the old test chambers we were solving a couple hours ago. I would still enjoy the mist. Our Aperture Science water filter and cleaning systems destroy 99.3% of human waste. So if you took a toilet break early on, don't worry. There is practically none of your urine in the air. <laughs> okay. I guess so it's three more tests and then uh, we should be completely done with testing. So that'll be cool. Oh man, this song again, this is amazing. <laughs>
ir. supposed to do here. Yeah, then it'll bounce to me. Or it stay in here though. No, it would not. This is definitely what I'm supposed to do though. Sorry that I'm staying silent throughout most of this, it's just me trying to figure out how to do this. And having a real hard time doing it. Getting brain damage here. And yes, nice flying I there. Did it. If my calculations are right, you came into contact with 0.21 milliliters of your own pee. See, it's insignificant. Great scientific progress is what we do here. Thanks. It's fantastic. This chamber only uses the blue gel, but don't let that get to you. This is one of our toughest puzzles. Whoever designed this has evil intentions and no mercy at all. But I am sure you will do just fine. What? Really? Oh, jeez. Okay. 
Ah, I guess I can't do it through there. Okay. It's gonna happen that I can... Eh, yeah, whatever. Oh, it's going through there. Quickly make it over here. Oh. I don't think I did that. Joking when I said that when I said that this was really difficult. I actually had to split this into three episodes instead of the originally planned two.
one's tough. be a follow detail if um uh, they had like um Wheatley in the space core somewhere on this uh, big starry wall that would be awesome I mean I guess if this is supposed to take place before portal 2 it wouldn't really make that much sense but still it would be pretty funny Aperture Science exotic location staging was so calm and peaceful. I hope it helped you with your thinking. Yeah. Also, I'm not allowed to transform the Aperture Science official nomenclatures into acronyms now. So we'll just have to live with it. Although it will not be long for you. Because we are near the end of the test, of course. Oh, sweet. Well, this is the part where he kills us. This is it. The last puzzle chamber, the final picture, the maybe not so grand finale. It's sweet. I got like lunar stuff. Oh hey, I got both uh, gels. That's sweet. It's awesome.
So many structures are extremely fragile. I'm guessing someone from civil engineering is gonna get sacked soon. Oh wait, I forgot that was there. I had to grab another one from over here. That was a bad idea. Okay, you managed to save it. near 
at the end of the test chamber now. Do not let me down. Oh, wait. <laughs> okay, I really hope it's saved. Okay. Okay. Good. We are almost near the end of the test chamber now. Do not let me down. And now that, uh, that, that would disappear. I have to get my drink, and I guess the orange juice is a lie. He went straight up in that, too. Shed out too many details, but get ready. Aim and fire! And someone from industrial engineering will be fired too. <laughs> well, so long for a dramatic and grand finale. Okay. Oh, sweet! I yes, always yes. That includes our testing. I must say. A great test subject, and I am deeply saddened by your fate. Oh, I wish there was something I could do to save you, but you should know by now. Testing protocol. I've looked into it, and this one does have its good reasons. So there's nothing I can do now. I will always remember you deeply. You know, you were my first test subject, and that means a lot, even to a simple personality sphere like me. Farewell, my test subject. Oh, oh, I know. There's this loophole that I can apply so that there's no reason for you to... die. Oh well, I guess I'll just pick another test subject at random. Test subject, Apple science, that's a need to learn a new thing. For the people who are still alive. Oh, I guess that's the end. Sorry there wasn't a lot of talking near the end, so that, you know, I was I was in my thinking mode. When I'm in my thinking mode, I don't do a lot of thinking. And I can't believe I knew Nigel was gonna betray us. I knew it. I knew he was out to kill us. So anyways, once uh, the video ends, I have a special announcement to make. So, yeah, I uh, look forward to that. Surprise! The video isn't over yet. Okay, so I just real quickly wanted to double check, and I found out that there is actually an alternate ending. And I wanted to real quickly get that out of the way before I officially end the video. That's my special announcement. So, yeah, so... Uh, so I really only know how to get it. I haven't seen the alternate ending myself. So, yeah, so what I'm supposed to do is I'm supposed to go over here. I'm glad that I looked this up before I ended the, the video, because I never would have found this otherwise. And I really wouldn't want this um, Let's Play to have me not find like any like specific special endings that I could get, so yeah. So I'm supposed to go over here, and then I'm supposed to go up here. Sweet science! You have the bladder of a pregnant woman! Go do your business and get back to the testing as soon as you are done. Oh, it's a toilet. Okay, anyway, so then I'm supposed to do a little something like this. A little something like this, and I'm supposed to put blue stuff all over this wall right here. And then I'm supposed to finish painting the walls. So then I'm supposed to go hippity hop on this blue wall, and I'm supposed to get over here. 
And then I'm supposed to go through this little section here. Again? You did your business not so long ago. Why do you even bother with exploring your surroundings? It's not like you're going to encounter a life-changing moment. I think this will be a life-changing moment. Okay, this is where okay, this is where I um from here on out everything is brand new to me on this alternate ending. But oh, I'm closing the incinerator. Oh, Nigel can't kill me now. Diana. Yeah, she's watching. Blah blah blah. Okay. I still wonder where is Glados in all this? Because like, is she like, is this like when she's asleep, or is this when she's like getting the facility back up and running? Now that you got that out of the way, we can go back and finish the test chamber. Yes, good. Okay. I think. Ah, dang it! I tried to do a special fancy little maneuver, but no, it didn't work. Okay. Well, that'll close up, and uh, I'll be able to finish the game. With the Alternative, alternative. Now that you got that out of the way, we can go back and finish the test chamber. Yep. We can. We are almost near the end of the test chamber now. Do not let me down. Now we just do the same old stuff we did last time. These poor defenseless turrets. Actually, now that I think about it, there are very few turrets in this game. I kind of like that. Mostly because I don't really like hurting the turrets. Shed out too many details, but get ready. Aim and fire. And someone from industrial engineering will be fired too. Well, so long for a dramatic and grand finale. Yay! And that concludes our testing. You were a great test subject. Uh, testing procedure says there should be a fire here, or you die, and that should have concluded the end of the test. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. Although I am very glad you did not have to die. Give me a minute. Okay, so your personality fits those of a previous test subject. She almost blew up the whole facility and killed my boss once. So I have instructions to let you go to avoid any future problems. Go through the door. Okay, cool. So wait, am I like... Oh wait, so I'm related to Shell? Cool. This elevator will take you to the surface. We won't meet again. This is it. Goodbye. You know, you were my first test subject. Will always have a deep place inside my gears. Farewell, my human test subject. Bye, Nigel. I'd say that was w wonderful, but you tried to kill me, so fair's fair. Oh, it's the turrets. You gonna find a little opera number for me? Oh great, we're not at the facility yet, are we?
And there we go, the uh, alternate ending, and what I believe is probably the true ending. Or what's in my mind will actually happen. So yeah, that was a very, very good game. I have to admit, I kind of like uh, Portal Stories Mel a little bit more. So yeah, but you know, this was still very fun. You know, I had a, a good, like, um... Had some pretty good graphics, pretty good characters. Okay, it was a pretty good character. Nigel was the only person there. Uh, and uh, yeah, a lot of the tests were really fun too. I especially liked all the um, uh, like sort of like this sort of like the speed things. Even though I was terrible at them, it was really fun to sort of racing around with uh, the orange juice and the blue raspberry and stuff. And, yeah, it was really fun. It was a really uh, really fun game. So yeah, I do kind of wish there was a little bit more like plot and stuff. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, um, like I feel like this was sort of a little underwhelming in terms of story. Like, it's really just a test subject going through tests with Nigel there. Like, we didn't get to see like anything like big or like really special, except for maybe like the fake rooms, but. Yeah, but you know, you know, it doesn't always need to be a big grand story. Sometimes it can just be like a small, fun little game. So yeah, this was a really good, ex good, uh, good game. I, if I had to rate it, I'd probably give it like a eight out of ten, or maybe a seven point five. So yeah, cool. Well, uh, that was it, and this is the very last, um, this is the very last uh, video of the very last let's play that I ever do on. The Willy the Wither channel, so... <laughs> I'm so sad. But I'm actually not sad, because I have a special announcement that I will be giving to you in 3, 2, 1. Alright, so, announcement time. I'm gonna try to keep this somewhat brief, but basically, um, I am... How you should say... I'm sort of rebranding, um... So I got like it's it's a whole story. I got a new email and stuff. So um, I am actually sort of migrating from this channel to a new channel. So yeah, that's why I kept saying that this would be the last let's play on the Withy the Wither channel. Okay. So um, yeah, I'll put a link for the new channel in the description. I might still make like a video every now and then on Withy the Wither. It's probably gonna become like sort of my alternate channel, but um. But yeah, for the most part, probably don't really expect, like, anything, any, like, a ton of videos from Withy the Wither. Expect most of them to come from Withy the Cryptid now. Um, however, uh, one thing, though, um, there is one video that I might make on Withy the Wither at some point, if I ever feel like it. I might make, like, I, I have been, like, open to the idea of making, like, a montage, just sort of a... It's sort of a goodbye montage to the Withy the Wither channel, since I won't be using it as much. But anyways, yeah. New channel, Withy the Cryptid. So, yeah, I'll add a link in, this, in the description. If you're subscribed to the Withy the Wither channel, I highly suggest that you go to the Withy the Cryptid channel and subscribe to that as well. And, um, yeah, if you're looking for any more of my videos, look for them in Withy the Cryptid, obviously, because that's where I'll be uploading most of my videos from now on. And, uh, yeah. See you later, peeps!